You know, I've been watching a lot of football and there's tons of car commercials and the cars look awesome, but right now I feel like buying a car is like buying like the last tube TV in like, you know, in the late, like the early 2000s. Like are cars in the next five years, just not, you know, just selfishly everyone in the room, like in the next five years, will the brand new car today look totally different in five years or is it, gonna, you're, it is safe to kind of like buy a car right now? Like you're expecting a huge thing, whether it's self-driving, EV, safety, you name it. Is there anything yeah. like really on the cusp for the consumer? So the, the thing about the way that car design works is the car, like the 2028, 2029 models are already underway. Like, there's already teams working on that. I do think it will change. And in fact, by 2030, software will represent 50% of the value of a vehicle. Yeah. Um, so I, I think in terms of features, yes, it will be, I wouldn't say night and day, but it will be a lot different in 2025, 2026. Yeah, you, you're a software guy, Alex. Like, are most cars going to be like the Tesla, the Tesla kind of method where you can upgrade the car, like you can upgrade your computer without having to buy new wheels? I think once you get to a point where the car is self-driving, it actually looks and feels pretty different, right? I don't know that you actually have all that much on the inside. Um, there, I know there's different opinions about this, but I think it's, you know, you want to use your phone, your laptop, the things you have. One thing that'll be really cool, um, I'm hopeful that in the future we'll see active suspension. I know there's been prototypes of it. And this would allow your ride to be much smoother so that you're sitting in the back working on your laptop, you can actually have a really smooth ride instead of getting bumped around. Yeah, you can have a, have a full meal in the back of your car. That's kind of cool. All right, we have, we have 40 seconds left. I want to hear a really quick, bold prediction in the next 10 years in mobility. Alex, go. I think we're going to have self-driving trucks. I said bold. Come on, you already have that. You're going, you're going public on that. Give me something else. <laughs> I want something more crazy? Yeah. I don't know. I think, I think the reality is it is going to be piecemeal but I think you are going to see the beginning of a transformation that you won't be able to look away from at that point. It'll be very clear that it's coming. Oh, all right, yeah. Trevor, blow my mind. 20, 15 oh, seconds. 15 seconds. Oh, my God. Um, okay, you're going to see flying cars by 2030. And He's I also better think, at this. I also think 15-minute delivery is going to be standard in cities for virtually anything that you want. Drones or uh, on wheels? Both. Both, all right. You can never go wrong ending with self-flying uh, cars. So that's great. Well, I want to thank Alex and Trevor. Thank you guys.